Construction has begun on Constitution Drive in West Monroe. NBC 10's Isabel Albritton spoke with officials and joins us live with more details on that project. Isabel, what's going on out there? Michelle, as you can see behind me, construction crews have already begun digging. Today I spoke with the city engineer about the purpose of the project and how long it'll be before it's complete. No doubt you've seen work happening here along Constitution Drive in West Monroe. It's a place where erosion has been an issue in the past. To fix that, city engineer Robert George says you'll see workers busy here for the next three months. The project will carry storm water away from the commercial park. They'll also repair erosion between Constitution Drive and I-20. City officials say crews began digging two weeks ago. Once they're done, the entire area will be covered with dirt, planted with grass, and leaders say it will look much better. Construction crews are starting to install box culverts. The boxes are seven feet tall and nine feet wide. They're designed to carry more than 235,000 gallons per minute. The entire project is $1.8 million. The city has received a million dollar grant from Delta Regional Authority. The rest of the cost is coming out of the city's budget. The city engineer also says they are expecting the project to be complete by the beginning of January, of January weather permitting. For now, live in West Monroe, Isabel Albert, NBC 10, your local news leader.